And the next speaker is Oscar Dikuwayu. Hope I did it. I said it right. Canto a mi mismo, an ideological rewriting of Whitman's Song of Myself. One of the greatest poets of American history has become uh, in literary in our Walt Whitman, one of the greatest poets of American liter literacy, has become uh, in literary in our Spanish literature since 1941. In one of his most famous poems, Song of Myself, we find principles of democracy, principles of brotherhood, principles of equality, principles of, uh, of heroism, etc. The primacy of this poem is therefore un unquestionable. And for this reason, Leon Felipe, one of our poets, decided to translate it as Canto Amimismo. The aim of this presentation is not just to talk about the greatness of Walt Whitman or to talk about the translation made by Leon Felipe, but as you may expect it from the title, to look into aspects that make Canto Amimismo unique among other Spanish translations. We know that not, not two translations are the same, but it's not always easy to determine the singularity of each one. And this is where now my research comes in. To to challenge some people's assumption that reading one translation is as good as reading another. After a thorough study of Leon Felipe's translation in conjunction with uh, other Spanish translations, I came to the conclusion that Canto Amimismo is impregnated with features that are specifically Spanish and was deeply affected by the Spanish Civil War in addition to being written in an English, in a Spanish that people call uh, Iberian Spanish. The salient use of, for example, of expressions such as tu palabra happiness la ha borrado mi llanto, o no viene a repetir catecismos ni a colgar una cruz en la sorapa, is clear indication that uh, Leon Felipe wanted his readers to be acquainted with the Spanish Civil War and through that make uh, people uh, be acquainted with the, the Spanish translation. Uh, to sum up, it appears evident that uh, the selection of expressions used by Leon Felipe, which have been forgotten by other translators, is not just innocent. It's, it's actually a mark of his ideology, and as such, it makes Canto Amimismo an ideological writing of Walt Whitman's Song of Myself. Thank you.